Taking a look at question number 16 from your 1.2 homework from page 13 of your textbook, we have in parentheses 5 squared minus 2 times 1 to the 5th power plus 4. We need to follow the order of operations to solve this. So I'm going to write off to the side a reminder of what the order of operations are. Parentheses first, then exponents, then multiplication and division from left to right, then addition and subtraction from left to right. So looking at this problem, the first thing we're going to want to do is start off with 5 squared. Uh, so the reason that I picked 5 squared was we have parentheses. So we have a group of parentheses, um, we have a multiplication, an exponent, and addition. Okay, from there we're going to start within the parentheses. Within the parentheses we have two different things. We have exponents and subtraction. Okay, so we're going to do the exponent first. 5 squared is 25. It means 5 times 5. I'm going to bring everything else down. Your problem should look just like the initial problem. Okay, now we have to with, keep working within the parentheses. We already did the exponents. Now we need to do the subtraction. 25 minus 2 is 20. Three. Then once again bring everything else down times 1 to the fifth plus 4. We've done the parentheses. We're left with multiplication, exponents, and addition. The next thing we should do would be exponents. So 1 to the fifth is just 1 times 1 times 1 times 1 times 1, which is 1. So I bring everything else down, 23 times 1 plus 4. We have multiplication and addition left. I'm going to do multiplication next. 23 times 1 is 23, so we're left with 23 plus 4. Our last step is to add those together, and we end up with an answer of 27. Remember, solving this in a different order would give us a different answer, so you have to make sure you're following the order of operations. Email me if you guys have any questions.